Hello, welcome to the first race of the season uh, for the British Touring Car Championship. Obviously it's a bit cloudy, a bit of rain today. It uh, wouldn't be the British Touring Car Championship if it wasn't raining on the first race. Oh, yeah. uh, so we're here at Donington, hopeful, hopeful uh, Bobby, Dan, all our drivers can do well today. Yeah. Um, yeah. Yeah, so we're... Uh qualifying didn't go as planned obviously some of the drivers have had no time in the cars uh, Bobby and Dan are both on new chassis so the cars have just been built um, however Dan did do quite well yesterday um, Bobby had a fuel pressure issue which meant that he couldn't do as well as uh, he wanted so hopefully we push today and uh, races one two and th rounds one two and three we get somewhere and see what we can do um, but also we popped down on Friday uh, to Donington to catch up with Bobby and and uh, here's what he had to say. All right, guys, we've uh, managed to make it down to Donington before race weekend. Caught up with Bobby. And uh, as you'll know, winner of the Jacks years last year, absolute phenomenal year for him. And uh, we're hoping for better this year, Bob. Yeah, I think I think it's going to happen. How are you feeling? Yeah, I'm, I'm, I feel good. As we just said off camera, I feel like I'm going into round 11. Yeah. Uh, I don't feel like I've had a winter break. It's <laughs> uh, as good or as bad as that can be. I've been flat out with other motorsport stuff and, and, and uh, yeah, and coaching other drivers and stuff. So I feel like I've been flat out at the track yep. non-stop. So yeah. Uh, yeah, I feel like I'm going into round 11. Um, the team are prepared, uh, some staff changes and some staff move arounds yeah. and, and some staff from some other teams joining us, but uh, Excellent. It's, uh, there's, a, there's a lot of experience up in the engineering room and that's great, yeah. pay off on so track. You're, you're feeling really good going into this season again, yeah. especially with obviously the, uh, the elation from last season. Yeah. Yeah? yeah. Okay, excellent. So uh, first question, what did you have for breakfast this morning? <laughs> <laughs> I had, which I'm having every day at the moment, a Starbucks oatmeal with yeah. jam. Um, in my head, I think it's really healthy. Yeah. But the amount of jam I had, I don't think it is healthy. But I, that's what I balances been, it out. I think it's the. I've had it. Today is the fifth day in a row I've had yeah. this oatmeal jam. But yeah, that's what I had. If it's working for you, it's keeping you the hunger away. Yeah, it keeps me going for the most of the day. Yeah, excellent. Right. So uh, back at Donington again this weekend. Uh, how are you feeling about Donington? Yeah, I'm confident. Uh, you know, it's probably the circuit on the, the calendar I've done the most laps at. Yep. Um, everyone's in a, a bit of a new one here with the track resurface. The whole yes. the whole track's been resurfaced. Normally we go to a track and they might do the odd corner or yep. or, or whatever. Here is a whole track resurface, and I've had you know I've been lucky enough to do some laps here on the resurface. It does feel completely different, uh, and it'll it'll make the car feel completely different as well. Excellent. So it's how we dial the car into the new surface. Yeah, but, you've yeah. got. A a slight advantage there then yeah, uh, yeah, with having yeah. to go on it already yeah, yeah. excellent right okay so uh, predictions okay so prediction for yourself how are you feeling this year what do you what do you think or what are your aims for this year yeah in, in, instead of a prediction i'll go for a goal okay um i've got a couple i've got i've got a, a i want to have a podium in race one or two i'll take one in race three yeah but it means you had a complete different race weekend if you have a podium at the start of a weekend yeah uh it means you've had a lot better on saturday uh and uh my next my next goal is uh i want to go into brands hatch the last round of the year yeah. uh, top seven in the championship um whether you come out there it doesn't matter it doesn't well, it does matter but it, it, it's yeah that last weekend anything can happen as we see last year so yeah um, yeah I'd like to go into the last round um, top seven yeah year. excellent that's that's good it's uh Good that you've got a goal, obviously, like I say, off the back of last year. Yeah. You, you did really well. And, um, yeah, hopefully more, more podiums this year for you. Obviously, not for the Jacks years, but proper podiums. Yeah. One, two, and three. Yeah, Excellence definitely. Will I be, think, uh, yeah, I think, I think we've got the independence to go to as well. Yeah. That's our, that's our most immediate goal, I suppose. Yeah. Um, yeah. But for me, it's personally, and, and for, from a team point of view, we've got to get... Yeah, we'll get some wins under our belt, and there's, I've got no doubt with the package and the boys and the, and the car we've got. Yeah, that, that there's no reason why we can't have a good That's few it. wins. And uh, lastly, independent team, you and Dan this year. So I know you guys get on really well. Yeah. Uh, we've spoken to Dan. Um, yeah. He's uh, looking forward to this season with you. So what are your feelings now? Yeah, yeah, it's it's, it's great. I mean, I've been mates with Dan for years. Um, you know, through through uh, the motorsport ladder. Yep. Um, he's a great guy. We get on really well 
out of the, out of the, out of the car. Um, from what I've seen so far in pre-season testing, we work really well together yep. and we're going to push each other along. Um, It'd be good to have that as an immediate teammate, in you know, in, in the car, in the, in the car next to me in the garage. So, yeah, um, yeah it, we're going to push each other along, and, and that's what I needed, you know. Yeah, so excellent. Let's see, let's see how we go. Well, we're all looking forward to uh, the start of the season this weekend, and uh, bring on a race win in uh, round one, two, or three. Yeah, I'm ready for or it. Even a podium, like yeah, you say. Let's do it. That's <laughs> it. But we, we want the win. Yeah, win will be best. So yeah, cheers, yeah, Bobby. Cheers, man. And uh, good luck for the season, mate. Thank you. Thank you very much. <laughs> so yeah, that was Bobby. Um, so he's in good spirits. So yes. Today he's going to do well. Um, as you can probably hear, the mini's going around now. Um, so yeah, today we can't film uh, the racing today. ITV have got all the rights. Yeah, governed so, by ITV, yeah. so we can't do that. But uh, we'll get some behind the scenes for you. We'll see what we can do. We don't yep. really know what we're going to film today, but no. with it being the first race, yeah, uh, we we'll get some behind the scenes. Um, yeah, we'll, we'll see what we can get. Who knows? Yeah. So uh, stick with us, guys, and uh, watch the action. Yeah. We'll see you soon. Goodbye. Bye. <laughs> So Andrew Watson, 20 points. Josh Cook, good comeback for him, 17 points. And then Aaron Gray. For um, <laughs> don't have money. So, And I think we just lucked into other people's misfortune and uh, yeah, made our way up and we're starting second. So I'm going to white line it and defend the whole race and not let anyone pass. That's my goal. Um, if anything, I'm scratching my head a little bit, you know. I don't want to say the words, but I think we need this. But we only have half an hour or something to race free. So we're going to try and make it through. Um, uh, yeah, I'll let Dan talk now because I'm miserable. Yeah, not, not, not my day today. We, we qualified really well yesterday up in P12 and 
had a really good start to the race, got up to P8 in the race one, and then unfortunately got knocked off. Um, and then we had a work cut out in race two, and unfortunately we, we chose, I chose the wrong decision of staying on slips. Um, it was a bit of a mess, really, and um, managed to get up to P14, and it was just a gamble, really. I, I went with the majority of the grid, and it was looking like it was going to go our way, and then and then just start raining on the safety car. So it is what it is, a bit of bad luck, but it's fine. There's there's some positives we can take out of this weekend and we, we got up in the in the top ten in race one, so it's all good. And uh, yeah, massive congrats to Nick uh, for what he did. Uh, really happy for him and um, see see what everyone can do in race three. Fantastic, thank you for that. fantastic weekend we've had uh, from round one which was a bit rocky so uh, both Dan and Bobby went off the track um, which was unfortunate Dan was in a really good position uh, up in eighth position um, 
and yeah, unfortunately got nudged off the track. Um, but they kept the head up and went into round two. Yeah, where um, Hamilton proved to be uh, pretty good behind the wheel. Oh yeah. Um, and it, I'm pretty sure that was that was the wet race. Wasn't the it? wet race, yeah, very wet. So um, a lot of things went wrong for some drivers, but luckily Hamilton just stuck to it. Yeah. Very consistent. Um, and just it kept his head down. Yeah, he made he made the decision to yeah. uh, to go in and, and change the wet tyres before the race actually started. Yeah. So he started from the pits, but with everybody else having to change, he sort of had the advantage there. So he seek to the weather gods saw that it was going to be a wet race yeah um, and it worked out for him in the end exactly uh, and then yeah moving on to race three yeah well reverse grid um put bobby in second position but then due to a disqualification he started in p3 um battled on from there um he, he was trying to keep the car going he said there was an issue but we couldn't see what it was from the uh, from the garage um but he kept on battling eventually finished in sixth position but also took the uh, the independent winner for the weekend yeah. so absolutely fantastic yeah so yeah on to the next round in brands hatch brands hatch so uh two weeks time is it yeah two weeks time yeah well, depending Start on when this goes out I'd yeah know. start of may brands yeah. hatch we'll see you then yeah Woo. Lovely. Lovely.